touch of arrogance. Potato! Superfly! Lucky, that's all! Incendio! Accio! These rocks have seen better days. how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. What seems to be the problem? You may well ask. I'm convinced I saw a grim, an omen of death. I'm not safe. But if it can't see me, I'll be all right, won't I? All I need is an invisibility potion. Yes, that's what I need. Well, as it happens, I have what you need. Here. Not sure it'll help you, though. Be careful, won't you? Oh, you're a gem, you are. I'll be sure to be very careful. And you be careful, too. No Grim is going to get me. Thanks to you, kind child. I must insist that you accept this small token of me gratitude for your thoughtfulness. Expelliarmus! Protego! Incendio! Seems a pleasant enough little place. Hogsfield is being terrorized by Ranrock's loyalists. It's not. I couldn't help but overhear. Did you mention Ranrock's loyalists? I did. <sighs> Never imagined they'd act this deadly. I'm Claire Beaumont, by the way. Nice to meet you. Ranrock and his followers have set up camp here. No regard for our beloved hamlet or our livelihoods. Ruthless. My brother Baldov dared to stand up to them and ended up in St. Mungo's simply at my wit's end. I am unfortunately quite familiar with Ranrock's loyalists. Perhaps I can do something. <sighs> Much as I would love to be rid of them, I wouldn't want you to risk injury, or worse. 
Please be cautious. We should not have to live in fear. This is our home. It seems as though things are getting worse. Bardo Bone should have returned by now. Had by dark wizards he was. Cleared. Madame Beaumont will be glad to hear that. Who lives here? Oh, I do miss the bustle of business. Poor Hello, Madame Beaumont. Good news. I was able to clear out Ranrock's camps. You cleared them out? How? It was harrowing, and they dug in their heels, but I managed. When my brother returns, this news will mean the world to him. You saved our hamlet, my young friend. This will not be forgotten. I fear for other hamlets, truly. Ranrock and his lot are unlike any goblins I've ever seen. What do you have for sale? What are you looking for exactly? Thank you. Sincerely. Oh, you'll like that. A fine choice. Thank you for passing through. Shane Bardolf thought dark magic was the answer. I reckon Rookwood's played a hand in his...
What do you have in store for me this time? There's a victory that came none too soon. Ugh. Hello. Do you have anything for sale? That I do. But uh, what's a student like yourself doing out here? Got yourself lost, did you? Just exploring the countryside a bit. Aye. <laughs> nice to break the routine now and then. Bit of a wanderer myself, in fact. The name's Leopold Babcock, and I am indeed here to sell. <laughs> now. For someone like yourself who is also prone to wander, I cannot understate the importance of keeping some Wiganweld potion on hand. I wouldn't dare set foot in a place like the Forbidden Forest without a steady supply. What do you say, my young friend? A measure of safety for the path ahead? Something to consider. Thank you for your help, Mr. Babcock. Aye, let me know if you see something you like. What do you have for sale? See if there's something you need. Thank you for your patronage. Thank you for your patronage. That's been a pleasure. Ah, oh, nothing like being young and in flight.
Hogsmeade, here I come. <laughs>